Good afternoon. Today is Tuesday, May 16, 2017. I'm Levi Clough. Syria may have been running an execution factory. We've got details. And I'm Tristan Perez. Think a lot of trash sports in your yard? Maybe not. Your CSN News starts now. There will be a free spirit bus to Bora High School for the state baseball tournament on Thursday. The bus will depart at 3.30 and return after the game. Come sign up with Mr. Potter in the front office. Attention Lady Wildcat basketball players. There is an open gym for girls basketball from 3 to 4.30 on Wednesday. Don't miss this chance to hang out and hone your skills. All track uniforms need to be turned in to Coach Kinnaman by the end of next week. Seniors, make sure yours are in so you don't have to pay for them before graduation. Seniors, the main check-in for all Columbia seniors will be Monday, May 22nd, 7 a.m. to 10 a.m. Device check-in will be a part of your entire senior checkout and will be included on your checkout form you need to turn in to graduate. To avoid waiting in long lines on May 22nd, two things will help. If you're missing your power cord or stylus or have any other damage to your device, go and document that in the library between now and May 19th and have the problem documented. This will help you avoid waiting in lines. If you have saved all your files to a personal OneDrive or Google account or other that you want to keep and you know for sure that you do not need your device for a final, then you can turn in your device early. At your convenience, go to the library before May 19th at 1 p.m. If you need help to make sure all your desired information is migrated to a personal media, an easy step-by-step -step document will be emailed to you and posted in It's Learning. We'll be right back after this. Attention all students who drive to school. Recently, there have been many hit and runs in the student parking lots at all three schools. It's a felony when you hit someone's car and drive off and you will be cited and reported to the cops and your driving privileges may be taken away. If both vehicles are occupied, then exchange contact information, license plate numbers, driver's license numbers, and insurance information. If your vehicle is the only occupied one, then leave your contact information along with insurance information and driver's license number and plate on the windshield. This message is brought to you by the Nampa Police Department. Today's weather is brought to you by Dr. Kim Keller. Your smile is your first impression, so make it a good one and visit Dr. Keller today. Today will be a high of 54 with a low of 38 and cloudy. Tomorrow will be a high of 52 with a low of 40 and rainy. The United States ex ac accused Syria on Monday of executing thousands of imprisoned political opponents and burying their bodies in a crematorium to hide the evidence. The allegation of mass killings came as the President Trump weighs options in Syria, where the U.S. launched cruise missiles on a government air base last month after accusing Assad's military of killing scores of civilians with a sarin-like nerve agent. Trump on Monday kicked off a week of meetings with Middle East, le Middle East leaders, sitting down with the Crown Prince of Abu Dhabi a day before he hosts Turkey's president. Trump flies to Saudi Arabia later this week. An uninhabited island in the South Pacific is littered with the highest density of plastic waste anywhere in the world, according to a study. Henderson Island, part of the UK's Pictarian Islands group has an estimated 37.7 million pieces of debris on its beaches. The island is near the center of an ocean current, meaning it collects much rubbish from boats and South America. The joint Australian and British study said the rubbish amounted to 671 items per square meter and a total of 17 tons. Researchers hope people will rethink their relationship with plastic. The SAT where the day is grimace, which means to make an expression of disapproval, disgust, pain, or discomfort. You can do it this way. The quarterback's grimace betrayed a fact that his ankle injury was still bothering him. Thanks for watching. And remember, if the news breaks, we'll, we'll fix, fix it. it.